So, um, one of the most important things for making something turn from an idea into a business is finding customers. Um, how did you find your first customers, Megan? Um, so it, it all started exactly with uh, me walking into grocery stores. And that is the scariest thing that I think most entrepreneurs can do. Because uh, most of us are idea makers. And so we got a great idea. And one of the first things I really did was try to find someone who would do it for me. Because <laughs> <laughs> I thought, OK, I got the brains. I'm just going to motivate this. And, uh, and that's not what was needed. Uh, I needed to go and make first contact. I needed to understand my customer. And the only way to do that was to dive right in and start talking to them. Why did you? Why did you decide, like, what specifically made it something that you had to do instead of outsourcing it to somebody else? Um, speed. Uh, I didn't want to wait around and wait for someone else um, to maybe make up their mind when I, I was really getting signals that uh, this was just going to be something that sat on someone's plate as a concept. Um, and so uh, I, had, I had the time, <laughs> a little bit. I had the motivation, and nobody was ever going to, to um, do it faster than I could do it right at that moment. Right. And so that's why I just dove right in and did it. Yeah. Deepak, how did you find your first customers? Um, well, we found our first customer again from social media. Like uh, when we were in the early phases, we launched the product. Uh, the product was up and running. And then we just tweeted that uh, we are providing such and such service. And then lots of people tweeted back, and one of the company, they were like, oh, we would like to use your product and services. So we then connected with them. And then providing this, like, integrated our solution. And they are our, still our customers since last two years. So it was pretty good. So you got your first ones on social media, just reaching out, putting out the, the possibility that Login Radius could solve a problem for people. Is that still the way you get? more customers? Now that you're at 120,000, does that still work to get the next? Yeah, word of mouth is definitely one of the biggest thing we have right now. It's still, like, people reach out to us. Uh, like, over 95% of the customers, they pretty much reached out to us. We never reached out to any customers. We are started, like, now we are in the phase where we have some of the marketing plans, and we are Start, we have started some of the marketing initiative. So now we are reaching out to some customers who don't even know that this kind of product could exist or anybody can solve our problems. So now we are putting the words around and then doing some marketing. Sounds good. And Joel, how are you finding your customers? Uh, when we first had our idea, we thought it was a good idea, but we didn't know if everyone, oh, we didn't know our target segment would agree. Um, so we comp composed a 15 minute survey, um, just questions about our idea, about if users would use this, and we just posted it on applicable, uh, applicable subreddit pages, Facebook pages, over Thanksgiving weekend at about 11 p.m. on a Saturday night. And we were hoping to maybe get maybe a hundred, a couple hundred responses. It was more so for even a class, actually. <laughs> and uh, I don't know about you guys, but to fill out a 15-minute survey at 11 p.m. on a Saturday doesn't sound too exciting. Um, when I went back to check the responses on su Sunday evening, we had almost 1,000 responses and over 11,000 words of qualitative research. Or, or, or feedback, sorry. And so from there, um, just reading through the comments, which I eventually stopped doing, um, <laughs> just so many people saying, I've been waiting my whole life for this, I really wanna help, you know, people saying, I can help design your logo, I can help program for you, I can help market. And so from there, that's when we really thought we had something, and so we're gonna kinda do similar marketing practices down the road to help attract those 